Alright. <clears throat> I found myself just standing back taking a look at what, you know, we do as a whole. You know what I mean? It's like... They say they teach us history in school. I don't believe they teach us history in school. Because 9 out of 10 motherfuckers live history. You know what I mean? We know somebody that was there. Like, for real. Or we know somebody that knows somebody that knows somebody that was really there. You can play them family stories if you want to. Them family stories ain't family stories. That's real life shit. You know what I mean? Motherfuckers are going to do what motherfuckers do. But that's besides the point. What I'm trying to get a hold of y'all is... Aren't y'all getting sick and tired of watching this motherfucker fuck up our country? I mean, it's almost at a point where a motherfucker would say, hey, fuck, let's go back to Bush. Bush, George motherfucking Bush, any one of them motherfuckers would be better than what the fuck Donald Trump is doing. And if you can't see that, you're a motherfucking fool. And you're in denial, which is all good. You know, shit happens. You fake the funk, you do what you do. It's all good. Move on. But it's one thing to acknowledge something and move on. It's something totally different than trying to act like or trying to make up something that's, that you know isn't what really went down. And that's the shit, that's the shit that kind of digs at me. And it digs, at, it digs at a few American people. Very few of them, they just wear, they wear it on their face. They wear it on how they how they look at other motherfuckers. They wear it on how... Prime example. It's like, why is it that everybody wants righteous to be all the time? You know what I mean? I can't, I can't always be. You know what I mean? I can, but I prefer not to because shit out here ain't going like that. You know what I mean? It's not. You know what I mean? I find myself learning new shit every day, and I can admit that. I can find myself finding out that what motherfuckers taught us in school and what motherfuckers said this and that, that shit wasn't accurate. I mean, you can fake the funk and act like it was accurate, but it wasn't accurate. So me being me, I'm going to find the facts because I'm righteous. I can't be righteous and not be righteous. Y'all find it kind of be <laughs> It is funny because my mom named me righteous, but at the same time, like everybody asks me, would you live up to it? It's a work in progress. Is that being cocky? No, that's just because if you come, if you know righteous and bend with righteous and know righteous and kick it with righteous, you know righteous straight to the point. It might be silly. It might be some bullshit. But guess what? I'm not going to sugarcoat it. If that shit is bullshit, that shit is bullshit. You know what I mean? And you can, uh, no. Waste of time, waste of American dollars, waste of a lot of shit. Let's get, let's get, let's get it together, man. Cause I'd hate to leave you motherfuckers in the dirt. I really would. Cause like they say, everybody has goals, careers. Man, fuck a career. You know what my career is? Money. That's my career. And I hope that everybody in America learns that when motherfuckers said hard work, hard work pays off. Even back then, the motherfuckers was word playing. Do you dig what I'm saying? Hard work does pay off. But that doesn't mean you gotta be some motherfuckers. Ass kissing, yes sir, coffee bringing, dick in the booty ass, motherfucking, eh, hey, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Dog, you're not their babysitter, homie. If they're your boss, they should be able to do their job. If your boss can't do their job without you, then they might not, they shouldn't be your boss. True statement. Think about that. But like I said, I'm just, I'm rambling on because I happen to see some shit and I'm hearing shit on the streets like, this, this motherfucker took, this motherfucker's taking healthcare, healthcare and pharmaceutical, pharmaceutical, pharmaceutical assistance on the prescription side from moms. Who does that, homie? Do you not have a mom? That's my thought. You must not have a motherfucking mom. You can't have a fucking mom. The way that you act, the way that you carry yourself, the way that you do what you do. 
You got to say fuck it. You have to. But like I said, you motherfuckers don't see because you guys voted for him. Guess what? Human nature, they're scared to say, oh, you know what? I fucked up. Guess what? You want you want the minorities to always admit when they fuck up or you want to make sure everybody knows when they fuck up. But when it comes to the next motherfucker fucking up, you want to sweep it under the rug and act like they're motherfucking perfect. So diddy, 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 diddy. That's not how it fucking works in America. That's not how it fucking works in life. You can only fake the funk for so motherfucking long. My homie. Take that to the bank, man. Bullshit, bullshit will come back on you. Trust me. I done seen it come back on me. And you know what? I had it coming. Yes. You put out bullshit, you get bullshit. You put out good, good will follow. That's my word. As righteous, that's a righteous public service announcement. I promise. Oh, all right, you just smoke weed. Yes, I smoke motherfucking marijuana. So fucking what? And if I told you the story on that, you'd be like, God fucking damn. The Nick strikes again. For sure, because all your all your stereotypes and all your what you've been told is all a fucking lie. Open your eyes and live life. Cause I know I got emotion. I know I got feelings. I know I got, I know I got the best interest for everybody. Cause if everybody's best interest is met, guess what? Everybody's going to be too busy being gravy to worry about the nonsense and the bullshit and this. And everybody's going to be doing them thing. Ain't no way in America should we have homeless motherfuckers. I mean, yes, some people are by choice. But if a motherfucker fought for our country, ain't no way they should ever be on a corner somewhere. That's a true statement. And I don't know how many, how many years have gone by that politicians have been pushing that bullshit ass story in your motherfucking ears. And you motherfuckers eat it up and put them back in office every fucking year. Every fucking year. And guess what? We still got homeless motherfuckers on the corner. Veterans, Purple Hearts, motherfucking black, black ops. Motherfuckers that will choke your ass out with two fingers. What the, what the? All right, y'all. I'm, I'm done. I just wanted to put that out there because it was on my mind, and I felt I needed to share that shit. But uh, now I'm about to go smoke. <gasps> Doesn't fucking matter. It's America. I do what the fuck I want. Holla at me.